Hey everybody, welcome back and Happy New Year. Um, today I'm going to show you a technique that I call altered dry embossing and it uses the embossing folders that go with the Sizzix and the finished card, I'll show you real quick, looks like this. This is actually my leadership swap but I just I made very few of them so uh, chances are if you're going to leadership you probably won't get one. I think I have about 12 to swap. Um, but better than nothing. It uh, uses one of the new celebration sets, uh, Vintage Labels it's called, and right now I'm just going to show you how to do um, the technique part. So I'm just going to go over the, uh, the altered dry embossing for you. So all you need is an embossing folder, and this is the new uh, Stampin' Up! Sizzix one that's called uh, Perfect Polka Dots. And you're just going to take your cardstock and put it inside. And this is actually a little bit smaller than a quarter sheet. The dimensions are five and a quarter by four. And you want to line it up simply because with the polka dots, if, if it's crooked, you'll be able to notice it pretty easily. Um, then I took a wooden frame that I just purchased at a craft store. And it's meant for painting or you know using with wood. Um, embellishments and stuff but you just don't need to do anything to it um, you just want to line your paper and your embossing folder up with the wood with the center of the wood and then you're gonna stick it on your big shot and I'm using uh, one tab tab one on the um, platform and also one cutting pad stick it in the middle of your platform and then just crank it through You'll notice that there's not a whole lot of resistance. It goes through pretty easily, but there is enough so that you get the embossed image and it only does the embossing where the frame was because that's where the pressure is. So hopefully you guys can see this and you can see that in the middle it's still flat. So if you want to add an embellishment or do some stamping in the middle, um, it's perfect for that. So it's a neat little way to kind of add a frame and some embellishments to any of your projects. So I hope you enjoyed it. Have fun!